Hey, how are you? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Drew, aka Booty Sweat, and today I have some interesting matches. I actually had my first online tournament in like three years that I participated in, and I managed to make second overall, which I thought was pretty good. So I just wanted to show you some of the matches from the sem semifinals and the finals, both of which were against some very good players, one of which was a, usually a Scarlet player, but she played Jade, and then the other was actually against Baylina, who is a professional Jade player. So. Anyway, hope you enjoy. If you're enjoying the Mortal Kombat 11 content, make sure you like and subscribe, so on and so forth. Blah, blah, blah. Let's get into it. All right, so the first match I had was against a another streamer. Her name is Molly B. You can go check her out on Twitch. But it was against her Jade. So far, we're doing pretty good. Now, we had some friendlies after the fact, and you could really tell that she's a Scarlet player primarily because... Oh, I dropped that combo. Because in the friendlies afterwards, she was really giving me a hard time, and she actually won those matches, but... Nice anti-air stand one. Trying to do that a lot more. There's the big combo. And I read the get-up attack into the into the sweep. So really solid first round, for sure. And this was our first match of the semifinals. The overhead low mix-up gets them sometimes. There's the big ol' combo in the corner. Love that. Look how much damage that is. That's insane. She had the... The Wake Up Jump 3. And at this point, you know, I'm I'm controlling the match really, really well. So, really, really nice first match. Uh, I was very pleased with how that one turned out. Alright, and here's the second match that I had against Molly B. There, I don't know if she meant to get that interactable or not, but... Nice, the amplif Amplified Nitro Kick. There you go, and there's that punish. So, I got that punish on that, and oh, there's the crushing blow, I love that. And because of that huge crushing blow, I'm about to make Big time comeback, I think. That's right, there you go. So nice big comeback to get the first round of the second match. There's the overhead into the low again. I don't know why that gets so many people. I dropped the combo. She could have punished, but she missed the punish. Crushing blow into combo, but I did not have the meter, which was unfortunate. But we're still doing really well. I just realized I have the, uh, I have all the buttons and the stuff. Oh well. It doesn't hurt to be able to see what we're doing, I guess. Put that in the comments. Do you, do you like being able to see the buttons on the side so you can kind of see, like, what we're, what we're doing? It might be an interesting aspect. She got the air-to-air. -air, I missed it. Here I was like trying to figure out what she was doing. She was kind of playing a little randomly, but anyway, good game to her. And uh, with that, I was able to move on to the finals. Okay, and so this is the first match against Baylina. Now Baylina is a professional player who has a lot more experience in this game than I do, and she competes with like Tweety and and Honeybee in them. So I didn't really have any expectations to win but I just want kind of wanted to see how well I could do and she was far and away there's the I missed the combo there but I was really really looking for that flawless block and I got it I thought I could punish that I think I could have with a different button but yeah she was far and away the favorite to win for sure Nice throw. And Baraka's... I don't know, he has a lot of bad matchups in this game, but Jade is one of his worst matchups in the game. So, not that I blame the matchup for losing to a player who's just better than I am. Um, but, for sure, uh, her playing Jade does not help. As you can see. So... Don't worry, the second match goes a lot better than that one did, but, uh, yeah, she's starting off strong against me, that's for sure. 
Okay, and this was the second match of the set. Starting off pretty strong, getting a nice combo here. Not reacting to the overhead like I should. The ping was good and everything, I can't blame the lag. I just wasn't. I just wasn't reacting. I tried to go for the blade charge there, but she read it and threw out her obnoxious jade buttons. Could have gotten the crushing blow there, but I didn't spend it for some reason. Overall playing better this match, although I still let her throw out that forward three. Is it forward four or forward three? Which one does it start with? I'm not sure. It's either four, either forward four, three, four, three, or the other way. I don't know why I let go of block there. I guess I thought for some reason I could interrupt it, but you cannot. I tried to go for the flawless block there again, but I missed it. I got the escape failed. There I went for the uh, for the low starter, but she didn't fall for it. I think she watched the matches versus Molly B and saw me do that a lot. There she goes for the random down two in neutral, which is something Jades do even at a pro level, I guess. And that's it. She chipped me out, so. And then she ends with the brutality, so. Good games to my opponents, for sure. It was a lot of fun, a really fun event. Um, and definitely go check them out. Both They both tw uh, stream on Twitch, rather. And uh, I'll put links to their channels in the description, so if you want to go check them out, they're both pretty good players. Again, Molly B primarily plays Scarlet. I think she's much better with Scarlet than she is with Jade. And so I think if she had played Scarlet during the tournament, she probably would have beaten me, actually. Because uh, during the friendlies, I had a really, really hard time against her Scarlet with Baraka, so... Uh, anyways, I'm gonna start playing Garrus as well, because I just... I realized with the two characters I play, which are Shao Kahn and Baraka, they both tend to struggle a little bit with zoners. Shao Kahn less so, because he has the uh, hammer lunge he can get over projectiles with. Um, but even still, a really good zoner is kind of hard for him to deal with as well, so... I'm definitely going to be playing a lot more Gearus as well, so look forward to that, and uh, yeah, I'll see you on the next one. Have a good one, and be blessed.